Hello everyone, you are watching Dancing with Data. You can find my content in an organized way at learnwithritesh.graphy.com. Some of the topics over there might interest you like Tableau versus Power BI, useful for your migration, so forth and so on. But today we are here to discuss how you can set default DS today. And that too in the form of a slicer. That means that you have the option pick today. Today is 2nd of December. I hope you can see. So it's 2nd of December and when I click on today, it shows me stats or CCS with respect to today. And if I come out of this, it shows me stat with respect to all dates over there. So how can we do this? Uh, I've seen other solutions as well, but I hope this will be the shorter, if not the shortest solution. So what are we waiting for? Let's get started. The very first step would be to create a calendar table because we are going to use this table as a slicer. So we can make use of calendar DAX and that will ensure that you have everything within the order state range from minimum to maximum. Before we move forward, ensure that you relate the two tables. Now let's move over to the table view. Here we go. So that is our calendar table or say slicer. Okay, let me go ahead and sort this in the descending order. So here you go. Now today, as I said that we are at 2nd of December. So we are somewhere there, right? So basically we need an another column for which other dates remain the same, but today's date should switch over to today, the name today or the string today. Uh, before we move forward, let me change the format to short date. So let's add a new column. Okay, the condition is if date is today's date, then it should be today. Otherwise, it should be the original date. So we'll go by that if we have the date slicer underscore date is equal to today, like then it should be today. That's what we want. Else, I want to have basically the original date. So if I do that and if I close the bracket, there is an error. It says expression that yields the variant data type cannot be used to define calculated columns because today is a string that we have put over there, whereas the slicer underscore date is a date. Column or the data type is as, is as date. Now let me just expand it. So let's try to format slicer underscore date so that it becomes incompatible to today. I mean, a string today. Basically, we need to format this in a different way. So we'll make use the function format over here. So let's go back. And instead of this, we can make use of format date. And this is the, the other advantage is in this format, you will be able to sort in a correct way. Let's rename its name to slides underscore date. And here you go. Now let's check if I just go down, you can see today is 2nd of December and you can see today as required. That means we'll make use of slice underscore date as slicer. So let's go back to visual or report view and now we can do it from the scratch. We have this new column and after that we need the new visual. The new visual is a slicer and I put my slice state over there. I think I need to reassign. It's not filter or slicer. Now it's a slicer. Okay. What about sorting? Let me sort this in the descending order. Now you see today that that's what exactly we wanted. Now at the now we need to check it first of all, and maybe we can change the slicer setting as well. Uh, vertical list we can have drop down, and here you go. So at the top, you'll always have today. When I click on today, you can see that everything changes to today, consumer, corporate, home office, all the three segments. Second of December, you see sales for that. And it will show you today's sales for the slice state. That is today, west, south, east, and central. Now, if I try to come out of it, now you see it for all. So you see all the segments from top to bottom. So we have three segments, but then you have multiple transactions for those segments. And, and if, if you go to this, 
donut chart now you will see the big number for sure because this is from top to bottom at table level now if i pick any other date so it will go according to that date ensure that when you publish this very particular report you pick today and publish so that tomorrow it will take 3rd of december as today so i hope this was easy enough for you all the relevant text that we have used will be there at description so what are you waiting for you can just go and try this for yourself this is ritesh signing off from dancing with data kyunki data hi data hai kya tumko sab kuch aata hai